Hi, I'm Deborah. And I'm Lawrence. And today we're um, unboxing the July 2020 Buddy Box. Um, Buddy Box is from the Blurt Organization, which is a UK mental health advocacy organization. And um, so, and as always, we pay for our own subscription boxes because we want to give an unbiased review um, of the box. Okay, and so this month is um, Invest and Rest. And as a matter of fact, on the back of the box, it says, cut out the door hanger below and pop it on your door handle when you need to recharge. And it says, um, currently resting. Well, I mean, there's no reason to wait, so I suppose we should get the box open. This is, I hate these. I really hate these. Okay, there. That one wasn't as difficult as it usually is. Okay, about this buddy box. It can often be easy to feel that our worth is tied to how much we can get done in one in a, in a day. With the amount of time that lots of us have been spending at home recently, we know there's been an overwhelming pressure to make to-do lists that reach our toes. To -do oh, okay. I was really confused as to what the hell that meant. Um, and make every meal we eat from scratch. If we aren't constantly working our way through an endless list of tasks every day, it can make us feel as though we aren't doing enough, and in turn, like we aren't enough. I mean, I am completely content sitting on my ass playing video games yeah, all day. I was just about to say, you know, when you have depression... That's not so much a problem because yeah. at this point, Lawrence and I are both just struggling with like trying to get through because we were both depressed from, you know, the quarantine, shelter at home, pandemic, whatever you want to call it. So we're just kind of like, you know what? If I just exist, that's good enough. Yeah, I don't need to. I'm not. A, I don't feel obligated to do any chores. I'm fine with spending the whole day trying to mod my Wii. Yeah, I mean, on the, my family Zoom call this morning. Um, I had just gotten on the call and I'm not sure what was going on before that, but someone said, so Deborah, what have you been cooking recently? And I was like, we eat like 90% microwave food. Let's see. Isn't I healthy, but... made Okinawa milk tea with boba this week. Yeah. I mean, that was about it. That was about it for the... You know, um, I suppose I can break out some of my cooking. recipes and actually do some cooking, but uh. it's just we're just existing. We're fine existing, yeah. and you know what? And if you're only existing, and you have Perfectly depression, fine. you know what? Even that's if you good. don't have depression, that's good too. Even if you don't have depression, yeah. this is a yeah. hard time for everybody. Just anyway, get, I think I think if we just say in like ten years we made it through the pandemic, we didn't die. People, <laughs> you know what? That'll be impressive enough as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. Anyways, sometimes we need reminding that our self-worth isn't measured by our productivity. And with the pressure to be constantly busy, it can be easy to forget to slow down and make time for rest. Um, that's why we've curated July's Buddy Box as a gentle reminder that investing time to focus on rest, to recharge, and readopt a healthy rout uh, routine is so important. It's packed with thoughtful hand-picked products that will encourage you to slow down and make rest a priority. On top of that, it will help you schedule in daily self-care anchors, encouraging you to inject self-kindness into your everyday routine. Hi there, Deborah. Here's an awesome buddy box for an awesome person, because you are awesome, you know, even when you don't feel like it or when your thoughts are trying to persuade you otherwise. Trust us on this. We're a great judge of, or we're a good judge of character. We hope that you love this buddy box from the Blurt team. Uh, I mean... Mm, I was gonna make a joke, but honestly, I'm I'm tired because I just I finally set up my Wii and have been doing Wii sports for a little bit. It tired me out, so I don't think I have the energy to make a joke right now. And this is what was on the other side. Oh yeah. First thing is travel friendly aromatherapy balm to help you stay centered wherever, whenever. Stop, inhale, reset. Temples, neck, wrist. There's a little diagram. Apply, apply to pulse points, wrist, neck, and temples. Inhale deeply and reset your mood. Repeat your new ritual daily. Restoring lifestyle balance naturally. Yeah. Sleep well. Palmarosa, lavender, and... I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. Key benefits. Clears the head. Quiet, quiet, quiets the mind. 
and relaxes the body when to use. The perfect start to your bedtime ritual, sleep well, is also a great travel companion when on the move, such as during air travel. It's really Amorosa, small. Amorosa, lavender, and your lung, your lung. This yeah. is really small. Um, yeah, but I think it looks like it's a solid stick, and those tend to last better. Oh, that's true. Because if it's liquid, yeah, it doesn't. Can, it, can we try it? Yeah, sure. I like it a lot. I didn't actually, have a chance to. The only, th um, yeah, you know what? I like all these, and I've used all these before. Hmm. Yeah, I like it. Uh, this is gonna be on my desk. Well, I guess it's supposed to be bedtime. Yeah. Mm. I'll, I'll, I would want to use it more often. That's nice. I like it. And you know what? Remember how we we when the box came, we were like, uh oh, it smells really strongly, and maybe something broke. This is a smart way also to send um, scent in these subscription boxes instead of instead of the. Um, uh, what am I trying to say? Instead of liquid. Mm -hmm. oh, and by the way, also, I did a video on how to make your own version of Peace, Origins Peace of Minds. And it's this kind of um, uh, solid stick. Mm. It's really pretty easy to make. So, um, I mean, you need to get... Yeah, you're, you, nice, you know your stuff. Yeah, that's through. nice. I like that. Anyways, I wonder what the hell this is. Um, a candle. A candle. I think it's just a normal candle. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I think so. Well, um, okay. Not really. Uh, I sure. suppose so. Uh, nothing wrong with it. The problem with these candles is that you have to have a candle holder. Oh, yeah, that's true. I um, mean, you could probably use some clay or something. Ah. Uh, oh, okay. It's a two-piece Now set. we, now it makes sense. But wouldn't this, wouldn't the candle wax still just drip through, like? Um, a lot of candles, it actually just evaporates. But that's a nice uh, candle holder, if that's what it's like. Let's see. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, Jesus, this barely fits. Only oh, the, like, it's too big? Yeah, only a tiny bit of it fits. That's okay. Then yeah. it won't wobble too much. Fair so, enough. So, that's nice. I like it. Yeah. It's pretty and it's minimal. True. Yeah. So, um, yeah, candles actually are really a nice thing to soften an area. Mm. You know? We have even more stuff. Lemon butter soap bar. Vegan, 100% natural. Cool. At Soak, we hand make vegan soap in our studio on Bodmin Moor Cornwall. Okay. Using plant oils and... <gasps> Butters that nourish, moisturize, and cleanse the skin. This lemon butter soap bar is made with lemon essential oil, fresh carrot juice, and shea butter. It's full of antioxidants plus vitamin A. Um, the only fragrance is lemon. So that's a lot of ingredients. You can read these if you want. I really don't want to. How's it smell? It smells mm -hmm. lemony. Um, I didn't actually smell it. it. Smells very lemony. Yeah, that's nice. That smells really nice. Oh, yeah. You know? Yeah, so that's a nice another pampering thing. Okay. Next, we have... No. 54 reasons why it's important to rest, relax, and recharge. Sleep is essential for consolidating memories. That's a quote, not a reason. Uh... We often have our best ideas when we're in switch-off mode. I always have really good ideas in the shower. I don't know why. I think it's because you're doing something automatically because you do it every day. I have, you know what I mean? Yeah, I have great ideas when I'm like just waking up, and by the time I'm like fully awake, I've forgotten it. You should keep a notepad. And... Yeah. Rest allows time for reflection and allows us to evaluate our goals and priorities. This is true. And one more. You cannot serve from an empty vessel. Actually, I'll, I'll read one of the quotes, because I've been ignoring those. Um, oh Jesus. Almost everything will work again if you unplug it for a few minutes, including you. Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to put those back in So the those box. are good. Okay, I like this one. Rest is not idleness, and to lie sometimes on the grass, under trees, on a summer's day, listening to the murmur of the water, 
or watching the clouds float across the sky is by no means a waste of time. It's John Lubbock. Actually, well, there are no clouds, but you know what? That is true. Yeah. The Naked Planner, a 30-day unbound planner designed to keep you or to help you carve out time for rest and make it part of your daily routine. Yeah. Um, That's the only way you actually get things done is by like putting them yeah. on a thing. Yeah, I mean this isn't bad. So uh Excellent. can I see uh, one of them? Sure. So it says good morning. How do you feel today? The date, how many hours slept? If you feel like that was enough, I can pretty much always say no. I actually kind of want to use these. How do you feel today and then why? Three ways I'm going to relax, rest, or recharge today. And then it's what, when, and where. And then I guess at the end of the day, you say what went well and what didn't go well. Uh, I may actually use these just to yeah. see how it feels. Just yeah, that's a good day. idea. Um, the other thing is that um, especially um, – during something like this during a pandemic and during the summer when you don't have anything mm. structured um the sometimes at the end of the day you can feel like wow that day went by i did nothing it's like the time just like f one hour flowed into the other and sometimes then like in the morning setting a goal saying i'm going to do two things today let's say and if you complete those at the end of the day you can say Okay, yeah. I did get a couple things done, um, and so I that, successfully modified my weed. Yeah, so you 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 accomplished something today. Yeah. Um, so. Oh, I didn't stream. No, I forgot. Oh wait, well it's not it's not like night, so I can still do that. Whatever. Um. Anyway, so uh, it's but when during this really weird time. Um, it's actually good if you feel like just every day goes by and just slips by and you're not getting anything done, um, then that's, then that's a good, you know, that's a good thing to try doing. Yeah. So I like that. You'd obviously like it too. So then here's the zine, which you, Oh, dog, dog. I mine. saw a dog and a cat. Oh, I like cats better. Cat happy. happy I prefer cat. smaller and smaller domesticated animals. That's why I prefer cats. Because yeah. they're easier to like hold and give affection to. Um, I have to say, I just uh, that I I'm not crazy about dogs because of the drooling and the, that too. Yeah, the drooling and the smell. You know? I, oh, cats are also pretty lazy, so I don't have to constantly attend to a really hyperactive dog. Um, that's actually not true. I've depends. known cats that like needed a lot of attention. You know, so. it, it depends on the animal itself. Yeah. I mean, I prefer something that isn't constantly. Uh, Trying to get my attention. And we, it's we had a medium sized dog when I was growing up that like oh, yeah. would try to get onto your lap, and it was not a lap dog. Anyway, so it says in this month's zine and untangling mindfulness back to basics. And I'll just read the, the beginning. For many of us, busyness is aspirational. We're encouraged to just do it, to love the grind, and to just keep hustling. At the same time, in order to keep up with our packed schedules, we're supposed to start bullet journaling download productivity apps, and drink ever-increasing amounts of coffee. Even in lockdown, as we all experienced an incredibly uncertain, scary, and challenging time, we still felt pressure to learn a new, to learn a new skill, skills, um, learn a new skill, do those outstanding DIY jobs, work out every day, and become a master baker. Shakespeare wrote King Lear and Macbeth while in play quarantine, don't you know? Um, yeah, so obviously they're saying basically what we were saying earlier. It's it's really too much because this is not a normal time. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I mean, there's so much stress and pressure and there's the uncertainty and everything. And that's if you don't know anyone who's sick or if you haven't lost anyone. Um, so, you know, it's we have to be more gentle with ourselves and expect to less. It's a freaking pandemic. You know? Yeah. I, I don't expect much from myself. Yeah. You, me neither. I expect from me. Um, untangling mindfulness. Oh, this is good. So there's often some confusion of, over what mindfulness actually is and how it applies to our life. I took a really good online course on Coursera on demystifying mindfulness, which I would definitely recommend. That, that was a good course. Um, 
And so that's, that's a fairly long article that's pretty dense. Back to basics. It says rest. When life gets busy, it's easier for our self-care to slip. Carefully cultivated, helpful habits often fall by the wayside and we turn into the frazzled, people-pleasing, self-neglecting version of ourselves that we thought we'd buried for good. So I liked this box. I thought this yeah. was a really good box. Um, we, you know, we got the zine with two, what looks like really good articles. Um, this, um, I, I don't know what it, we call it. Planner. Planner. Well, planner. Well, rest, relax, rest, relax, recharge, planner. Cause that's what the focus it looks like is on. So, um, uh, what did that say? Naked planner? Yep. Oh, the naked planner. Yeah. The na so we liked the naked planner. Um, we definitely liked that. And I thought the card pack was good. They have a lot of really good card packs also on their website. Um, they have a shop on their website. And um, I would definitely recommend looking at it, even if you're in, um, if you're not in the UK, because I ordered some stuff from them and I don't remember it being uh, exorbitant as far as the mm. delivery charge. Um, it was when they were having a sale on, so I don't know if that's why I remember it that way. Um, the card pack, the candles, nice um, to, for some to create a little atmosphere. The soap smells wonderful. And this, again, I think between this and the planner, those are my two favorites, I think. Mm. Um, so then I get this and you get the planner. So sure. that seems fair. Fair, fine with me. What did you think? Uh, yeah, I mean, I thought this was a pretty good box. I thought the planner is definitely something useful. And it's one of the few times I've actually showed interest in the more, the, the less material things, the yeah. ones that actually have a purpose. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I mean, I don't have much interest in like the, 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 lemon butter soap bar or whatever the other thing was. Um, <laughs> but you know, this, this was a pretty good box they've kept with their level of quality. Yeah. And again, this is a box. What I like about their boxes is that, um, you feel that if you sent one to someone that it would really be a, a really nice comforting, yeah. you know, kind of like message to them. No, I, I think it would be with. definitely. Yeah, I mean this these in particular because we've tried other subscription boxes where, um, you know, we were like, eh. I mean, you know, we couldn't see sending it to someone because it bit like it just there what it would there wasn't enough there there. Yeah. You know, and of course also we don't want to forget the door hanger. That was a nice way to um to use I the like box that. to utilize the box. Yeah. So, um, so anyway, um, buddy box, another good box. I, if I remember, I really liked last month's box too. And I believe you liked it too. Yeah. So, um, I feel like, um, I feel like they're being consistent as yeah. far as the quality and, um, it's definitely something that we can recommend. Well, uh, we hope that you enjoyed this video or found it helpful. If you did, you can give it a like. If you want to say anything at all, you can leave it in the form of a comment. And if you want to see more content like this, you can subscribe. But in any case, uh, we hope that you had a nice day. Or, well, had, are having, and will have a nice day. Take care.